Hi everybody, this is Miss Broad and this is a Year 1 Fractions lesson. In Year 1, for fractions, we look at half and we look at quarter. So half is when you have two equal parts in a shape and quarter is when you have four equal parts in a shape. So when you're choosing your shape, choose really carefully because they need to be the same on both sides and around. Otherwise, you will find it difficult to halve and quarter them. So the best shapes to stick to are things like circles and squares and rectangles, triangles, pentagons and hexagons. Those will be your easiest shapes to halve and quarter. So I went around my house and I chose a couple of things. So um, to make my circle, I drew around some hand cream and to make my square, I drew around the coaster. Now the next thing I did was I coloured them in, but you could use coloured paper if you wanted to, or you could colour them in, but um, make sure that you're doing it really carefully. When you're drawing around your shape, perhaps ask a grown up to help you with that. The next thing I did was I cut my shapes out, like this, and to find half, what you need to do, is make sure that you fold it really carefully across the shape and then open it up and it is the same on both sides so this is equal to this and that is half when you make two. To find quarter you first need to find half and then halve it again. So remember to find quarter you're dividing your shape up into four. So when I pull it apart there are one, two, three, four equal parts of my shape. And I can do the same with the square. So I can find half first by folding it carefully over. It's a little bit tricky with one hand but with both of your hands I'm sure you'll do it very well so it's the same on both sides There's, it's in two so that is half and to find quarter you do half and then half again again it's a little bit tricky for me because I'm doing it one handed but I'm sure you'll do a much better job with both hands I'd like to see what shapes that you find that you can half and quarter when you have done those, there are some additional sheets in the homeschool learning pack. Mrs. Gilbert has found a brilliant sheet for you all to have a go at that you can cut out. So again, you can use your scissor skills for that. Take your time, don't rush it, and good luck with halving and quartering your shapes. Bye for now.